welcome back to my channel. So today, oh, I am so excited. I am doing a video that honestly has been truly highly requested on my channel. Anytime I ask either here on my community tab or on Instagram, what sort of video you guys want to see from me, so many people have said a beauty room tour. So that is what we are finally here to do today for you, a whole beauty room tour. I'm not going to lie. You guys have pretty much seen almost every single angle of this room because when I'm sitting here, you see like that way. And then when I have it flipped around and I'm sitting there at my table and doing like get ready with me's, you're seeing like this part of the room. And then in most of my shop, my stash videos, I literally go through those drawers and like pick my makeup. So honestly, you guys have pretty much seen slowly over multiple videos, like bits and pieces of this room, but this is just all of it combined into one video showing you everything, trying to remember where I got everything for you guys. So in case you're interested in any of them, you can check it out. I will say I decorated this room and got it pretty much done almost a year ago. So some of these things are going to be outdated. They might not still be available, but I did get almost everything from Target, Amazon, and Ikea. So I hope you're excited because I'm telling you, this has been so highly requested. People want to see this video and I am so excited to finally bring it to you. I'm sorry it took so long. I had to do a bunch of cleaning and organizing and I feel good about it now. So before I get started, don't forget I upload every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday for you guys. If you like this video while you're watching it, please go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. It really does help me out. And other than that, if you're excited and you want to see my beauty room tour, then let's go ahead and get started. Okay, really quickly before we actually get started, sorry, sorry, I want to do a little disclaimer. I feel like I shouldn't have to do this, but I'm sure someone's going to click on this video and be like, why? Why do you have all that makeup? And I really, I don't even have the excuse of that I do this full time and that's why I have so much makeup. Like a lot of the other beauty gurus, when I watch their beauty tours, it's literally like, well, I do this for a living. That's why I have so much makeup. That's not the case for me. <laughs> I don't do this for a living. Hopefully one day we shall see. But um, I just wanted to say, I started my Instagram account three years ago now. So I am on a few PR lists. I really want something. I try to be patient and wait for it to be on sale. I've gotten BoxyCharm in the past and I currently get Ipsy in PR. My friends and family know that I love makeup. So a lot of the times they get me Ulta and Sephora gift cards for like my birthday and Christmas and that kind of stuff. So I just want to put a little disclaimer out there that I know I have a lot of makeup. I know um, it's probably more than, it's definitely more than anyone needs and it's probably excessive but I love makeup so much it is my hobby I love it I've loved it for like a decade and a half and I just genuinely it makes me happy so if you're watching this and you think like this is too much makeup it is but just know I love it and this is my hobby and this is what I spend my time and money on you know what I mean so just try to go into this makeup tour room with like an open eyes, open heart, not judgmental or anything like that. All right, so now that I got that out of the way, let's actually get started and show you my room. <laughs> okay, so when you first walk in, I'm just gonna kind of give you like an overview. So this is the closet. I have a bunch of my filming stuff here. And then that is the desk that I normally do most of my like talk through videos on. That's my little corner where I have a cute little table and chair. Some more like decorative things. That is from Ikea where I hold a bunch of my makeup. This is a cute little rug from Target. <laughs> I'm gonna try to remember to tell you where everything is. And then when you come to this side of the room, we got like my little trash can, my desk area, where I have most of my makeup and all of that. So let me try to run through like where I got things. So the desk was actually from my parents' house. I've had that desk literally forever. I need to get a cushion that matches. It's blue, it doesn't match, but that's life. Um, but it's actually was my old desk in my old bedroom. And I was like, hey, can I take that from you guys and use it in my makeup room? And they were like, yeah, sure. So I don't know, it's from like a random furniture store around here. These are obviously the Alex Nine drawers that are from Ikea that like everyone has. The mirror was actually in our house already. Um, the old people, I guess, just left it here. And then Mike added those two lights for me. He got all the stuff for that from Menards. And then that mirror is from Target. That is from Amazon. Um, the lamp right here is from Target. My best friend Courtney got me that little organizer. The candles from Target. That's from Ikea. <laughs> I got everything from Target, guys. The chairs from Target, the tables from Target. This, I don't remember where I got this. I got it from some website. If I remember, I'll try to put it down um, down below. 
these cute little guys I got from a place called jane.com. They had like just little um, prints on sale one day. The shelves I got from Amazon and all of that. And then that is from Ikea. The curtains are from Target. And then the gold curtain rod up there, I don't know if you can see it, is also from Target. And then this side is pretty plain. I mean, I just have like my filming equipment. That closet is a hot mess, so I'm not gonna show you. And then this is a pretty bare wall, but that's because the door opens to it. And so I didn't think if I put anything on it, it would get covered up, you know what I mean? And then that little guy, hmm, I don't remember where I got that from, but hi. <laughs> so yeah, let me like dive in, show you a little bit more up close. Okay, so this is my desk that I do like my makeup at. There's really nothing in here. It just kind of opens up. But in here, these are kind of a hot mess. So just like bear with me. So this top drawer is just kind of like a hot mess of things. It's a whole bunch of random samples that I need to try. Some makeup remover wipes. I have tape. This to light my candles. That kind of stuff. Nothing too crazy. This has a couple backups in it. And then mainly just towels that I use for like makeup application. And then this one is like a hot mess. It has, oh gosh, that is so dirty, sorry. But this is just a whole bunch of my like makeup bags. A lot of them I get from Ipsy. This was from BoxyCharm. So I just got a whole bunch of makeup bags down there. Then on top of my desk, I actually got this little organizer from a giveaway. Um, I won it from one of my friends on Instagram, but a, a ton of different places like have these type of um, organizers like on Amazon, Container Store, all of the above. So in here on top, I just have some lip glosses and stuff that I use before I get ready. This is the lens I use for all my Makeup Macro Monday pictures, some perfume samples, my dossier of uh, Flower Bomb, some like of my recent like favorite lipsticks are just up here. I haven't put them away yet. These are a bunch of lip glosses, liquid lipsticks, that kind of stuff. This first drawer holds all of my concealers in it. And then this second drawer is just a bunch of lip glosses, mainly lip glosses, yeah. And then on the side here, I have my Fenty glosses that I don't know what to do with yet. So I just haven't put them away. And then I've got these cups on my drawer or on my desk. So this one holds like my makeup cleaner, my scissors in case I need them, a bunch of dirty brushes. Don't judge. I'm terrible at washing my brushes. I, it's just who I am. So I got like all my eye brushes. These are the main face brushes that I use. And these are face brushes that like I should use, but I don't really use them very often. And then this cup has my lip liners in it. And then my little handy fan that I use to dry my setting spray with. And then my mirror is on top. Mike made these for me. They're like from Menards. He just kind of like put them together um, when I decided to come in here and make this like my whole makeup room. So that was really, really sweet of him. And then over here on top of my Alex 9 drawers, I have my mirror that I love and then my just little tissue box and then some of my palm trees and 80 degrees candles. These are like the best candles on earth. If you have not ordered some of them yet, I highly, highly recommend. They smell delicious and they last like a really long time. I obviously have sun-kissed citrus burning right now and I just, I love those candles. So not going through the Alex 9 drawers, don't judge, you guys. <laughs> I feel like a lot of my like makeup organization I have in these drawers, I don't love, but it's what I've got going on for right now. So when you open up the top drawer, this is all of my primers. I don't really have them in like drugstore or any sort of order. I just have really my minis over here, just a bunch of like the small sample sizes. And then I try to kind of put them together like hydrating in the front, more moisturizing, pore filling in the back. But these are all of my primers. The second drawer, oh, the second drawer is all of my foundations. And I know I've got a lot of foundations. I try to have this a little bit organized. I have like drugstore over here that are like a little bit more affordable. My favorite current foundation, I have it on today, the Physician's Formula Butter Believe It. I love it by L'Oreal Infallible. My ColourPop, this is another one of my favorites. The Catrice, my e.l.f. Camo Concealer or Camo CC Cream my makeup revolution so i have like my believe beauty over here the um Sika clearing so i have like um just try to do more drugstore over here and then this side is my more high end so my pure my tart found sealer uh charlotte tilbury these two i used to have on display but i was like never reaching for them so i kind of forgot about them so i put them back in here but below that we have my rare beauty my it cosmetics my shiseido another favorite huda huda stick dior yeah i try to have this little organized but as you can tell 
it's a hot mess. However, I do know where everything is. <laughs> then my second drawer down, this is another kind of like hot mess drawer. So mainly on this side is all of my powders. I only have a couple pressed powders and then I have my loose powders all back in there. And then this side is kind of like a hodgepodge. It's a, I got like my NYX glitter primer, my MAC paint pot. I just always use these. My color switch that I use every time I do my makeup. And then I have my mini Natasha Denona palettes and then just some other palettes back in here that I don't really have like displayed anywhere else. Else. This is a new one to me, my line and define tapes. So I've got like single shadows and stuff back in there. Um, my Raw Beauty Christie, my Huda Caramel um, Brown palette. So just like this is kind of like a hodgepodge, honestly, of just mixed things, but mainly it's powders and eyeshadows. And then one down, this next drawer is a bunch of eye things. So these are all my eyebrow things I try to again keep them a little bit more organized where on this side I have more of my like pencils and that kind of stuff and this side's more of my gels I've got my powder my color pop little um wax stuff <laughs> these two are highlighters so I try to do like high-end and more affordable it doesn't really always end up like that so I have Natasha Denona um, Reezy, this is a Jouer one. Um, I've got my MAC, two Becca's, an Hourglass, and then this side I've got Ofra, which is obviously high-end. Garnier Cosmetics is a little more high-end. Then I've got Anabla is high-end, but then I have Juvia's Place, Wet n Wild, ColourPop. Um, my Charlotte Tilbury is here just because it doesn't fit over here. And then this is all of my mascaras. I try not to have too, too many open at once. I kind of have more open right now than I really love to have but this one is almost done my oma drama bomb this milk one's almost done and so it's fine i it's just i'll just use these up and then not open it anymore you know coming up and then my little lash comb that i have to use when my lashes get clumpy and then back here is all of my eyeliners so this is just like a, a hot mess like it's like my liquid liners pencil liners it's like colorful ones brown black tan i don't have too too many liners so they're just all here and it's high-end and drugstore then this drawer is all of my blushes i do have this hourglass more like highlighty kind of palette these are all of my blushes this is just kind of like powder blushes and then more cream blushes and then we have a mixture here so i've got like powder powder cream i have this on today i used it for the first time and i put it over a powdered face and I was thoroughly impressed by how much I loved it. It's it's really great. Some Cloven Hollow, Flower Beauty. So I've got like all my creams here and then all of my powders here. So Hourglass, ColourPop, Elf, Lancome, M Cosmetics. I need more of these. My MAC Glow Play that's brand new to me. Some other MAC. So yeah, I, I love this drawer. I love blush so, so much. And then when you go down one, this is getting into my bronzers and more of my face palettes. So all here are bronzers. We have powders in the front and then we have some more creams back here. So my Fenty cream, my Tarte one, my milk, and then my cover effects. I just, I really love these. I need to, oh, I clearly need to use them to, and get some more use out of it. And then we have more of powdered ones. So Hourglass, this is, I can't, I don't know. Okay, Ofra. I didn't know if it was Ofra or Clove um, Hollow. Then we have my Nabla one. And then this little baby one is this uh, NARS one that I just got for my birthday set. I haven't used it quite yet. Then we have Clove Hollow. We have my Fenty powder, my Milani, my two city bronzers, my new one and the one I'm trying to use up. Over here, we have some face palettes, my new Glowish bronzers, my Bare Minerals, my Lumi. And then these are face palettes and then more single bronzers that are just too big so like my Marc Jacobs Omega my Charlotte Tilbury um what is this oh my Jouer so yeah oh this is also um pixie highlight palette I know my highlighters are a couple of drawers above but it doesn't fit up there so that is that and then some more face palettes on the side and then way back here I have my uh false lashes but I like never use them so they're back there <laughs> and then the second drawer or not the second drawer but the next drawer is a bunch of my setting sprays so i actually need to go through these there's a bunch of these i don't really use like the morphe one i don't use i've got a bunch of minis but for the most part like i got my Dislick, my fenty i love those all nighter the all-star the shot tubber i just opened this full size it's amazing i actually am liking this item one quite a bit and then my catrice ones when i want to be dewy and then back there is just some like puffs and that kind of stuff this is full of like just makeup that, oh gosh, I need to go through because who even knows what's in there? Not me, not me. 
and then some other setting sprays that I actually don't really use so I need to really go through this and then these bottom true drawers oh wait this one is um my lipsticks so this is a whole bunch of brushes that I need to go through I've just really collected brushes over the years through boxycharms and ipsy and I just have like a whole bunch and then these I used to store my brushes in but then I got the gold ones instead so I just have them here for now and then this is mainly liquid lipsticks and lip glosses so I've got some liquid lipsticks these two face set that like I probably should get rid of because they're almost three years old but I just love all four of them so much I like don't want to get rid of them I've got my dose of colors liquid lipsticks and lip glosses my pixie liquid lipsticks some color pop some kkw that these are also like getting really old some of this was set in pr like these pixie glosses i don't really use very often but yeah so that's what's down here and then this last drawer is definitely more just storage it's like my friend got me this little like spinny um makeup brush cleaner which is actually honestly amazing i need to use it more often so and then i've got the cleaner that goes with that and then some extra like sponges and that kind of stuff this is more just like storage we will go through this whole thing so on top here i just have this lamp that i got from target like i said i thought the gold was really cute i have this little picture of mike and i from our wedding my mom got me this is gold if you can't tell so it matches the theme um our last name starts with h so that's why it says an h on there then this thing like i said my friend courtney got me this and i just love it it's so perfect i have a whole bunch of lipsticks and lip glosses up here ysl flower beauty mac my maybelline lifter glosses and natasha denona one and then this is where those uh, foundations were but like i was just never reaching for them so then i just put one of my other handles there i'll eventually replace that with something this little drawer right here i have my elf bite size palettes i have four of those this drawer i really don't get use out of it just has like some pixie like little things that i don't really use in this jewel uh brush that's just cute it came with my highlight i never use these are more of my single shadows so i have like my hourglass i've got a tart one in there some color pop some ace beauty ones that i got from boxycharm forever ago then some l'oreal ones that are really old but i just really love them a lot then down here I have more single shadows. I really don't get a ton of use out of single shadows, so I just kind of have them tucked away. So I have like my Kosas 10 second ones, a little nude sticks ones, this from Lucky Chick that I got in PR a while ago. I've got some pixie ones, some tart down there. So yeah, I just don't really like use this drawer too, too often. Then these are like, this is like my backup drawers. I like panic bought two Smashbox Audition lipsticks because I'm pretty sure they got rid of them. And then also I picked up another Kylie Cosmetics Creme Brulee because these these are like two of my favorite lipsticks ever. So I just kind of like bought extras. I probably didn't need to, but I did. I got my Gimme Brow here. And then these are a bunch of, um, like I said, extra mascara. So I have a liner that I got, a Stila one, my ABH mascara, another one of my Grande Lash Boosting Formula, a roller lash, my clear brow gel that like I don't think i'll ever have to dip into because the mini is lasting me literally forever um milk makeup um mascara so that's just extras and then these are just palettes down here that i don't reach for too too much we got my pixie this catrice one my all things equinox and she's got solstice honestly when i feel like eventually when i do a declutter i'll end up getting rid of these ones for sure i don't know about these we'll have to see and then over here, I just have a gold candle I got from Target. It's like the um, Magnolia one from Chip and Joanna Gaines. And then these are actually my wedding flowers. These are my wedding flowers that are dried. And we had them up above our cabinets in our kitchen on display. And then our cat kept going up there messing with them. And I was like, no, buddy, you are not messing up my wedding flowers. I love them so, so much. And like the pink sash, it just kind of all goes in here. So I ended up just putting them in here on display. And I think they go really, really well. I love having them up there. And then down here is just a whole bunch of other makeup. So on top, I have just some of my palettes. You can see me <laughs> through the glass. Hello. I just have some palettes up there. Um, really no particular order, just like on display. And then some more over here. I got these gold cute little things from Amazon. They are actually office supplies. I wanted to go ahead and say that if you cannot find like cute display items, go ahead and look up office supplies and they have a lot of different things that like aren't necessarily makeup display items but you can use them that way so like on this side i've got these cute little gold drawer or glass jar well actually they're plastic but this has perfume samples this has been <laughs> free perfume samples from sephora for years so just like don't judge that i've got my um 
nail polish is back there and these are just mini mascaras that I need to eventually use up and then down here I've got more of these um, gold baskets I love these this has empties in them and this has just brand new items that I need to test out and try eventually and then down there I keep all of my like lifestyle empties that I don't really want to put on display because they're not cute so like soaps and that kind of stuff on this side like I said I've got my um, eyeshadow palettes up there I've got more down here and like a clear container that's not as cute so I didn't want to put it as as far on display and then I've got all of my lipsticks here I just got this thing off of Amazon so I've got really again no particular rhyme or reason I just have a whole bunch of lipsticks so I've got Charlotte Tilbury, Kylie, True Luscious, Max, Smashbox, um, some ColourPop back here, Clove and Hollow, um, these are uh, Bare Minerals, some Becca, some Ilia, um, more MAC. So yeah, I just have my Fenty, my Grande Cosmetics. I just have a bunch of those on display. And then both of these down here are also empties. These are about to be way more empty. Um, after this, I'm planning on filming an empties video. So these will be emptied out. I just kind of keep everything I've used up. I just put it in my bedroom and then eventually carry them over here and just stack them in there until I do an empties video. And then there's nothing down there. So that is this little case. And then going to the left of the case, we have this cute little chair that I got from Target. I love this chair so much and it's actually really, really comfortable. I like really wanted a super blush pink room with a pop of green chair and it just came out absolutely perfect. I love the little touch of the pillow on the side or on top of it with like the little makeup accents. I think that's so sink and cute. And then above it, I just have these cute little, I wish, I wish these were in display on the back of my videos, but both ways I sit positioned, like you can't see them, which kind of stinks because I think they're really cute. And then here, I just have my ABH um, palettes on display, all, all six of them. I got all these on sale, so don't judge too, too much because like I said, I got all those on sale. And then I got these two um, shelving units from Amazon. And then this cute little thing, my mom got me this. It is so cute. It's like a gold, like Christmas tree kind of thing. And it's all ornaments that have to do with makeup. So like, I love makeup. Makeup is my art. Choose your weapon with a bunch of brushes. And that, I just think that is so stinging cute. So I wanted to put that on display. And then here we have this cute uh, table. I love this table. I love the gold accent. I think it's so stinking cute. I got this from Target. And then on top of that, I have a fake plant. I got my little coaster from Ireland from when I went there in 2015. And then Mike's snake plant that he is very, very proud of. <laughs> and then, yeah, like I said, this is the other table that I usually film at. And that is pretty much the tour, guys. That's pretty much it. So let me do like one more final overview as I'm like standing in the corner. So my desk, my chair, and then my display thing with my lunch of my makeup. And then again, my other desk where all my makeup is and my Alex Knight drawers. So yeah, that's pretty much it. And then in the corner is the door. And that is my whole room. <laughs> And that was it, you guys. That was my beauty room tour. I showed you essentially every square inch of this room. I love how it turned out. This was definitely a work in progress. It started when I started my Instagram page about three years ago. And then I just kind of slowly over time taken over the entire room and just made it my own. I love the color I painted it. I really like how it's all decorated and I just really, really love how this all turned out. I really hope that you enjoyed this while you were watching. I hope it maybe gave you some inspiration on ways that you can organize your makeup or maybe it was just entertaining and you just liked seeing the tour. If you made it to the end of this video, thank you so much. You're awesome and I love you. Please subscribe if you have not yet and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye guys.